Your Evolution Steamer control panel features six buttons. Power off and on, timer start button, time up or down buttons, cook or hold mode button, and cavity temperature button. For connectionless models, ensure drain pan is in place and drain valve is closed. Open the door and fill the steamer with two and a half gallons of water or until water level is at the water fill line. Once filled with water, close the door and press the power on key. The steamer will display preheat on the control panel, letting you know the steamer is preheating. Once cooking temperature is achieved, the display will change to cook. Your steamer is now ready to use. If you have an Evolution steamer that is connected to a water and drain line, simply ensure the drain valve is closed and turn the power on. The steamer will automatically fill with water and preheat. Once in cook mode, simply load pans into the steamer, close the door, and push the timer start button. The default time is 30 minutes. At this point, you can use the up and down arrow keys to change the timer settings. Once the desired time is selected, there is nothing else to do. The timer will automatically start. At the end of the cook cycle, the Evolution steamer will buzz to let you know that it is done cooking your products. Simply press the timer button to stop the buzzer and then remove food or place into hold mode. Once the cooking process is complete or to hold at any time, simply press the cook hold button to toggle between cook and hold modes. The display will tell you which mode you are in. The hold temperature is preset from the factory at 185 degrees. This can be changed if you desire so. Turn the steamer off and wait for the steamer to cool. Open the drain valve to drain water. Remove pan racks, steam distributor panel, and steam collector from the bottom of the steamer. Clean the water sensors on the front left-hand side of the cooking cavity with a non-metallic scratch pad. Clean all of these components and rinse the cooking cavity with clean water before reinstalling. Wipe down the door gasket and leave the door open overnight. Use caution when discarding water in the drain pan as contents may be hot. Turn the Evolution steamer off and allow to cool for 15 minutes with the door open. Open the drain valve and let it drain completely into the drain pan. Discard the drained water using caution as it will be hot. Replace pan under the steamer before proceeding. Close the drain valve and add one cup of white vinegar to the cooking compartment, then fill with water. If you have an Evolution steamer that is connected to water and drain line, close the door and turn the steamer on. It will automatically fill with water. Turn on the steamer and set the timer for 20 minutes. At the end of the time cycle, turn the steamer off and allow the steamer to cool with door open for 20 minutes. Then open the drain valve and allow the water in the cooking chamber to drain completely. Use caution when removing drain pan as contents may be hot. To rinse, simply flush the interior of the steamer with clean water, leaving the drain valve open. Inside the cooking chamber, remove the pan rails, steam distributor, steam collector using the handle, and overfill sensor ball if equipped. Simply wipe off the sensor ball as it will cause the steamer to alarm even when the power is off. Clean the water sensors on the front left-hand side of the steamer with a non-metallic scrubbing pad. Wipe the inside of the cooking chamber with a clean cloth. Reinstall the steam collector, then resting the steam distributor on top of the steam collector, align the four retaining fasteners and hand tighten. Then install the pan rails. Make sure to wipe the door gasket clean and leave the door open overnight so the cooking chamber can dry out. This will also extend the life of your door gasket. When cooking large batches of food, your cook times will be shortened by breaking up food into more shallow pans. Instead of using a 4-inch deep pan, use two 2-inch deep pans to speed up the cooking process. While most foods do not need to be wrapped in your Evolution steamer, if you are using film wrap, use caution when removing from the steamer as pools of hot water will form on top of the wrap. This water can cause burns. We recommend using a stainless steel lid upside down to create a dome over the food product that sheets water off the top of the pan instead of making these pools of water. For more hints and tips, see our recipe book or call us at 800-210-5907. You can even drop us an email at chefs at accutemp.net.